Welcome to The Man in the Middle. I am your host, Bill West. Today we're going to be looking at a book, a series of books called Backyard Starship. What happens when uh, you go to Iowa after your father, or your grandfather has passed away and he leaves you his farm? Well, when you find out that's not all he left you, you're in for a hell of a shock. The main character, the Backyard Starship, like I said, goes to Iowa. He's, uh, you know, getting, he's trying to deal with his grandfather's estate. And while he's walking around, he accidentally finds a uh, sentient starship and a combat AI in the form of a, you know, a bird. Probably, you know, falcon or eagle, something, you know, ser uh, serious. And he finds out that his uh, grandfather was part of an intergalactic peacekeeping organization, much like the Green Lantern Corps or the Lensmen. Uh, the series follows, uh, hold on, main character is Van Tudor, he, you know, he follows in his, the footsteps of his grandfather and uh, joins the extra galactic, pe or the intergalactic peacekeeping force, and it's his adventures. Uh, it's a really good series of books. I, I really can't, uh, uh, say enough ab enough about this. Uh, like I said earlier, it reminds me of uh, uh, the Lensman series by E.E. E. Doc Smith or the Green Lantern Corps with a very hefty dose of uh, capitalism in it. It's not enough that you go out and uh, fight evil. You also have to pay for the sh repairs of your ships or any upgrades. They, they, they just don't come magically to you or uh, because of uh, largesse from the the government, no, uh, you go out there, you buy, you have to get bounties, and you have to pay for the upgrades on your ships or your weapons or you know whatever you want to do, buy your fuel. Well, uh, while he's on his van, is uh, on his adventures, he meets up uh, or gathers around him. A diverse group of uh, heroes. We have, uh, like I said, Nettie, his uh, sentient starship, uh, the AI bird, I can't remember his name right now. Uh, we also have Vance, Van's soon to be girlfriend, or uh, at the end of Legacy of Stars, you know, they, they're together. And uh, another alien who. Big, big, big <laughs> uh, alien who uh, who loves nothing more than beating people with uh, hammers. She's also an engineer. Uh, the the books are uh, they're fun. Uh, the good guys are, are are mostly good. I mean, there are some, you know, there's shades of gray, but the bad guys are bad. <laughs> you know, there's. You know, there's there's not much to endure endure you to the bad guys. They're they're evil, and you know you have good, you have evil, and you have a little bit of gray in the in between. And it's they're very enjoyable books. I've read most of them as soon as they come out. Uh, Backyard Starship Origins just came out yesterday. I will be getting onto that one as soon as I finish the book I'm currently on. You're not going to go wrong with this. I've read a lot by, uh, let's get this off, <laughs> by Jay and Cheney. Uh, Terry Maggard, I've probably read, uh, I, j I don't know right now, but I've read a lot by Jay and Cheney. Uh, you're, I, you know, I can't wait for a couple of more books of, their, of, of his to come out, or hers. It might be her, I don't know. But uh, you're not going to go wrong with this series. It's absolutely enjoyable. Hey, Boo. Baby Boo. You want to come up here? I don't know if you, you remember Cheska. She passed away almost a year ago. And this is uh, Boo. This is her replacement. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, she's... My pretty girl. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, 
pay with the cat. Uh, either free on Kindle Unlimited. You know, you pay $9.99 a month. If you're not on Kindle Unlimited, uh, they're $4.99 a book. And if you want uh, paperback, they're $24.99. I believe you can also... Uh, I think Jan Chaney has his own website where you can also order them from him. Per, uh, from him. Or her. Or them. Let's say them. <laughs> uh, the bad guys in this are a cabal of... Uh, pe pe uh, I'm going to say people in the broad term. Uh, they steal the uh your intelligence or your soul or whatever it might be what if what are you going to call it and uh, they put you in a chip and they make you do instead of ai you're you know you're acting as an advanced form of ai whether it be running a waste receptor or a waste cleaning robot uh door opening ai uh combat and they go through and they're freeing these people, you know. I'm not just saying. I'm like I said, the people in the broad term, you know, not just humans, but the aliens and everybody. They go through and try to free these people and take down this cabal. Uh, an enjoyable series. I, I really can't say much, enough good about this. It's it's a series that uh, I almost want to say young adult. Uh, there is some language issues in the later books, I believe. I don't remember anything in the in Backyard Starship, but I think later there's some swearing and maybe some uh, not blatant sexual situations, but, you know, the, the Van and his girlfriend, you know, do what people do. <laughs> uh, the, the AI... The combat AI who's in the bird, and I wish I could remember his name, or its name, is uh, is such a great character. It's uh, you know, play between him and Van or so, is is such fun, and uh, we we get to see, uh, like I said, Origins just came out, and well, I hope we get to see you know where Van's grandfather uh, got looped in on this and his uh, relationship with the bird and Nettie and the, I can't remember the name of the peacekeeping organization, but uh, it's, it's really, I, I really hope we get to see more of the interplay there. I'm looking forward to the next book. Uh, where Van's story is, because I'm really, I'm, I'm really invested. Well, uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me that thumbs up, drop a comment down below, and, uh, you know, I hope, uh, I get to talk to you soon. I'm not quite sure. I have another video to roll out later this afternoon. I'm going to, uh, uh, go rest my voice. I'm getting scratchy. I'm waiting for my doctor to call back on my uh, my leg. I <laughs> might have to go ahead and x-ray today. <laughs> but uh, you guys take care and uh, have fun. Have a great day. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye.